Hi, how are you today? Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Nice to see you. Vamos a ver. Okay, we're seven. Ready? Thank you. Nice, nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. I'm in class. Oh, you get Where? What do you mean? Yeah, the one that is in the box. I don't have this. Yes. Okay. I'm making up a day. I'm making up a day. Okay. Well, let's see. Now we are 10. Perfect. Let's go for the attendance then. Mm -hmm. Tell me present as I call you. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Well, this is our class number 21, right? 21, uh, remaking the day for class seven. It's class 10, uh, March 17th, right? Good evening. Uh, hello. Hi, Rosie. How are you? I'm okay, Tisha. Excellent, excellent. Bueno, vamos a ver. Tell me present as I call you, eh, Brian Alexander, Camilo, Clarixa Maribel, Daniel Eduardo. Present teacher. Thanks. Deborah Stephanie. Deborah. No here, Deborah. Okay. Elmer Antonio. Present teacher. Nice, nice. Eric Gerardo. Eric. Present, yes. Okay. Erika Joana. Present teacher. Nice. Guillermo. Isaías Santana. Yvette Elvira. Present teacher. Carla Vanessa. Carla Vanessa. Luis Enrique. No here yet. Manuel Antonio. Present Miss. Nice, nice. Reina Estela. Reina. Rosibel. Present, Miss. Okay, great, great. Okay, Vanessa Victoria. Present, Miss. Excellent. Elvina Lupita. Present, Miss. Thanks. Belisario Antonio. Present. Okay, um, let's see if we have new people. I'm going to call back the people who didn't say present at the beginning. Let's see if we have somebody text, right? Brian Alexander, Camilo, okay. Camilo. Yes, Camilo. Excellent. 
Eh, Clarissa. Deborah Stephanie. Isaías. Carla Vanessa. Miss, Deborah está intentando entrar porque no la deja entrar tampoco. Tiene problemas para entrar. Sí. Okay, bueno. Yo creo que tendría que ser de verdad el mismo, el mismo link, sino el que les mandaron ahora para, para revisar. Bueno, vamos a ver, Luis Enrique. Reina Estela. Ok. Bueno, it's nice to see you again. Some of you on vacation. Are you on vacation already? Yes. No. No yet. Ok. Some are on vacation, right? No, Miss. Nobody is on vacation today. Uh, uh, when is Until Thursday. Until Wednesday. Wednesday. Yes. Wednesday. Oh, I see. I see. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bueno. Y le vamos a poner entonces el número a la clase, el número 10, hoy mismo. Número 10, porque es eh, la clase que se va a estar reponiendo hoy. Well, I'm going to share eh, the attendance. I'm going to share, share the attendance. I'm going to share the screen. Un estado de, de vacation quiere, quiere estar con un montón de notificaciones ahorita. Va, perfecto. So, this is our class, at our video conference number 10, the one that we are replacing, right? That we're retaking in one more time. So, we're going to be doing some exercises related to vocabulary and practice of unit number two, right? That's the one we are uh, retaking and we are covering. And the objective is participants will be able to role play a conversation in which one employee is asking for a raise correctly using the vocabulary and the grammar and building the unit. And this is the vocabulary, a part of the vocabulary we were learning during the unit, remember? We were talking about steps to make a purchase order, right? So what are some of the steps that we follow when we want to make a, an order, right? Or we want to, to buy something online. A ver, what do you remember here?
what are the steps for buying something online? Let's see, match the steps. We have one half on one side and the other half on the other side. So let's see how much you remember and how you can match here. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, logging. For example, uh, logging to your account. Logging to your account. Ah, logging, logging to your account. That we let me get a pen. A pen here. Login to your account. Uh, Confer the methods of punishment. Confirm. Confirm the method of payment. Confirm the method of payment. Check the price, miss. Check the price. Check the price. Go to the uh, oh, oh. right billing billing address. address. Right billing address. Price. Write the billing address. Go to the only web. Only web page. page. Go to the web page. Only only web page. Online online web page. Online web page. Yeah. Credit card. Select the items to push information. Mm -hmm. What else did you say? Credit cards information. Select the eight. ¿Cómo se pronuncia la palabra? Eight. The item. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Items. Items. Select the items. Select the items. Uh, to, put, to, to purchase. purchase. To purchase. Okay. Select the items to purchase. Uh, Confirm your information. Submit. Confirm your information. Submit. Submit. Confirm. The information and submit. Okay. And credit cards information. Information. Credit cards information. Okay. Like that. So you have credit cards information, confirm your information and submit. Select the items to purchase. Go to the online web page. Write the billing address. Check the price. Confirm the method of payment. And hello. Good evening. Hello, Luis Enrique. How are you? Fine, Miss. <laughs> Excellent. No vacation. Okay. Yes. No vacation. No vacation. Nice. ¿Quién necesita vacation? <laughs> Vaya checking. Checking, checking, right? That that's um the the complete thing of what we were just doing here. Mm -hmm. No questions? No, miss. No. Vaya, okay. What is the order? What is the order that you will give to them? Mm -hmm. Log into your account. Uh -huh. Log into number your one. account. Mm -hmm. Number one. Number two. Number one. Go number to the online. Two. Log into your account. Which is number one? Log into your account to go to the online web page. Mm -hmm. Go to the go online to the web online. page. Okay, go to the online web page and then log into your account. Mm -hmm. Number two, number three, sorry. Right. Select the items to purchase. Select the item to purchase. <laughs> and then 
Check the price. Check the price. Aha. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Confirm the method of payment. Confirm. Mm -hmm. Check billing address. Credit card information. Credit card information before the, the billing address. Mm -hmm. No, uh -huh. primero la. Billy Al. Mm -hmm. Remember what we said here? That in some places or in some countries for some items, they do not accept credit card payment, right? Do you remember? <laughs> <laughs> yes or no? Uh -huh. So first, credit cards information or billing address information? Mm -hmm. mm. Mm -hmm. No, confirm it, sorry. la dirección. Write the billing address. Write the billing address. Because if they tell you, ah, uh, to that place, we do not accept credit card. You have to pay in a different form, right? Uh -huh. Then the credit card information, mm -hmm. and then company information. Company information, <laughs> information and submit. And submit. Huh? Good, mm -hmm. good. Any question there? <clears throat> no question. No, miss. Okay. Nice. Now, if we are going to be talking about this. This, this, right, singular and plural, this, this, that, and those, right? And those. A ver, when do we use this? This and this. This singular, this and this. Cuando... Ajá. This y this and singular y plural cuando están cerca los objetos. Exactly. That, that y those cuando están lejos. Exactly. So we use them to talk about people or things that are near, right? So this is a nice cup of tea. Whose shoes are this? Whose pencil is this? Right? Whose scissors are this? Remember, uh, you should keep into account words that are always plural. Scissors. For example, scissors. Scissors. Right? Scissors, shoes. Mm, ¿Qué más? Scissors. Hands. Those words are always plural, right? So we have to keep in mind those, those words too. So you say, hmm, whose scissors are this? Right? Whose hands are this? Because those are words that are always plural, right? So we use them with this. We also use this and this when we want to introduce people. Then you say, this is Janet. This is my son. This is my daughter. Hey, this is my brother. Right? So if we want to introduce somebody, we use this. Oh, this in case of plural, right? So we can say, these are my friends, John and Michael. Yeah. These are my friends, John and Michael. So if I want to introduce somebody or someone, I'm going to use this or this. Also, uh, well, we have to take into account this. 
we say, this is John and this is Michael, right? So you can say, these are my friends, John and Michael. These are my children, eh, Pedro and Juan, right? These this are my nice. friends. This yeah. is the night of love day. If you're going so to show the people, yes. we say that. If we are going to uh, present the people, we say, this is John and this is Michael, right? This is John. I cannot say these are John and Michael. Like what we will say, what we would do in Spanish, right? In Spanish, we will say, eh, estos son Juan y Miguel, right? But not in English. In English, you have to say, this is John. And this is Michael, when you are introducing to someone, okay? Uh, when you are at the phone or you are on the phone, uh, you, in, you introduce or you will start your conversation or you answer the phone, say, hey, hello, this is Soila. Can I speak to Sally? This is Soila. So I'm talking on the phone, right? Hello, this is David. Can I speak to Sally? Hello, this is, and you say your name. That is when we are talking on the phone, right? So I call, I, I make a call. I'm looking for somebody. We say, hello, this is Soya. Can I speak to Sally? Or if you answer the phone because somebody else called, you say, hello, hello, good evening. This is is uh, imagine if I tell you, is Roosevelt there? No, she's not here. But you can leave a message, right? Aha, uh -huh, but who am I talking to? Ah, uh, this is Fulanito. So you don't say I am, you say this is, right? So instead of saying, hello, I am David. Can I talk to Sally or can I speak to Sally? You say, hello, this is the <laughs> Yes, right? And that is special when we are on the phone. Any question up to here? No question? Sí, buen, con buenas noches, teacher. Fíjese que yo he tenido problemas con la con la Zoom. Se me ha estado, se me ha estado desactivando. Okay. Entonces, este, yo quería, quiero que, que, me, que me ayude medio a darme orientar porque me había conectado y me volví a, se me salía, me sacaron y ahí sí estuve. Ok. ¿De que me puede hacer el favor? ¿De qué, Clarixa? De, o sea, de explicarme de ah. cuando <ríe> es el dis y el dis, me, me, el, el, he tenido problemas con el Zoom. Vaya, he tenido remember... que volver a reiniciar. Ok. But remember, Clarissa, this is a review, right? This is a review. And we said that we use this when we're talking about singular, and we use mm -hmm. this when we're talking about plural, right? If we're talking about singular, so I say this is a pen. This is a pen. Perdón? This is a pen. Ah, un lápiz singular y plural, this y this. Exacto. Por ejemplo. Exacto. Okay. So you say, this is, this is a phone, right? This is a phone. This is a glass. So I'm talking about something that is near. But if I'm talking about something that is a plural, I'm going to say, for example, if I'm talking about pants, or I'm talking about an item that is plural, in that case, I'm going to use not this, sino que this, right? These are scissors, this. These are my scissors, you see? Because scissors, you see, pero solo es una tijera, sí. Pero la palabra scissors is Google, right? The same as pants and shorts, eh, socks, sneakers, those are words that are always plural. So when we refer to them, we can use this or those, depending on the situation, if they are near or if they are far, yeah? 
And what I was saying, Clarissa, is that, for example, when you want when you answer the phone, you say, hello, this is David. You don't say, hello, I am David, right? You say, hello, this is David. Can I speak to Maria, right? Instead of saying, hello, I am David. Right, let's move to the Como una conversation, conversation. When you're answering the phone. When you answer ah, okay. the phone, when you are on the phone. Uh, por teléfono, the phone. Mm -hmm. Especially if you are if you're answering the phone or if you're making a call, right? So the first greeting you do. Now check when do we use that and when do we use those? We use that for singular, right? And we use those for plural. Remember, as uh, the other one was to talk about something that was near. This is to talk to talk about something that is not near. It's to talk about something that is far, right? To, to talk about something that is far. If something is far, I use that and those. So you say, those, what's that? Hey, what's that? Hmm, those are very expensive shoes. Shoes is plural. So a shoes is plural. We use those. This is our house. And that is Rebecca's house over, over there. Cuando yo digo over there is por allá, right? This is our house and that is Rebecca's house over there. We're talking about something that is far. Now. Let's see, we have a couple of minutes before we go to the to the to the letter, right? To complete the letter. Check. I'm going to leave you with this exercise, but we're not going to the groups. We're going to we're going to do it individual, right? Right now. Because in Eight minutes. <laughs> I think it's In eight minutes, we're going to be completing the satisfaction letter. Okay? So look at the sentences. Just choose the correct option. And I want to know also if you have received all the information that you will need to complete it, to complete this document. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, choose the correct option there. Okay, are you ready? Let's see. Number one. Hello. This is Sandra okay. speaking. This is Sandra speaking. Okay, hello. This is Sandra speaking. How may I help you? Number two. This. Mm -hmm. This or this? This. 
This. The first one? No, the this. second. This. 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 Okay. Jeremy. These are my parents, Catherine and Royer. Hello, it's nice to meet you. Nice. Now let's go for these other two sentences. Mm -hmm. The number was that. Okay, ready. Ready, ready. Yes, teacher. Okay, choose the correct pronoun to complete each sentence, right? Number one. Who's that over there? Who's that Judge. over there? The over Judge. over there. I know the face, but I can't remember the name. Who's that? Yes. That. Uh huh. Number two. Yes. This. This is. That is. This is. Uh huh. When we say that, we use this to introduce somebody, right? Rita, this is Paul. He's an old friend from school. Oh, hi, Paul. How are you? Okay. We still have time to do two more. Who are? Those. Who are those people? Who are those people? Who are? Mm -hmm. Who are those people in that's the house? They are in this, So mm -hmm. it's as that. Those people. Number two, look. This, this is look, this, this is this, 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 this is my business card. This is look, this, this is my music card. Business, business, this my is business, business. Mm -hmm. it's my business card. Business, by after, after we complete business. the letter of satisfaction, we're going to come to this exercise. Okay. No, I'm just a thing. Tell me, uh, did you receive the email with that information for completing the satisfaction letter? Check, check your emails. Check if you received the email. Check, check. Ready. Yeah. 
buy it. Please check if you received the email that you need to use for completing the information. Mm -hmm. Completing when good night, good night, good evening. Uh, I check if you receive the email that says satisfaction letter. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Excellent. Well, don't start yet. We are going to start by watching the video, right? Let's watch the video first. Tell me if you can listen. Can you listen? Yes. Okay, perfect. La información con los datos correspondientes del curso. Para que pueda silenciar a la satisfacción, teacher. Sí, sí, sí. Vaya, lo voy a dejar en mute. Miss, fíjese que a mí no me ha caído. Vaya, ya vamos a ver entonces. Esa... ¿Por qué no lo pega aquí en el chat? Vaya. Pero ya link. mandaron el link en el eh... WhatsApp. Ahí está el link. Vaya, oiganme. Vamos a escuchar ahorita, vamos a ver el video. Y luego vamos a ver el resto. Ok. We are ready. Let's be ready. Como video preparativo, vamos a apoyar para poder desarrollar lenguas de comunicación de manera correcta. No te recibirá tu correo electrónico. La información con los datos correspondientes del curso. Vamos a seleccionar el enlace para poder desarrollar la encuesta de satisfacción. Vamos a regresar al correo que hemos y vamos a colocar el número de la orden de inicio siempre proporcionado. La vamos a copiar tal cual está en el correo electrónico y la vamos a colocar en el siguiente número 8. En el siguiente punto vamos a colocar el nombre completo, que es de cada uno de ustedes. Lo vamos a copiar de igual manera en el formato compartido y lo vamos a colocar en el número completo. Siguiente a ello, vamos a colocar el correo electrónico personal que ustedes se han proporcionado al inglés corporativo. De igual manera, vamos a utilizar aquí el número de contacto que ustedes han seleccionado. Lo vamos a copiar. Y así lo vamos a colocar en el número de contacto. Posteriormente, colocamos el sexo. En el punto número 6, vamos a desplazar la chuchita. Vamos a buscar el departamento de residencia donde ustedes actualmente viven. Vamos a colocar en el sitio en el cual ustedes están recibiendo. En el punto número 8, vamos a colocar el nombre de la empresa. Cuidado en este punto, ya que vamos a colocar el nombre de la empresa tal cual la relación social y nosotros lo tenemos registrado. De igual manera, nos hemos compartido el nombre correcto para que ustedes puedan colocarlo. En el nombre del proveedor, vamos a colocar de acuerdo a nuestra información, que es inglés corporativo Real International. Vamos a desplazar la fecha y vamos a buscar el nombre de nuestro centro de formación. Lo seleccionamos y en el siguiente punto vamos a colocar el nombre del curso. De igual manera, vamos a colocar nuestra información que nosotros hemos proporcionado para el correo electrónico en forma de A copiar el número del curso. Y vamos a colocar. En 
en el punto número 11, las evaluaciones procederán de de manera individual y personal de los ustedes adquiridos en el transcurso del curso. Aspecto de inicio, de igual manera, las vamos a poder verificar en la información que se abre. En este caso, nos vamos a ir al calendario y debemos tener el cuidado ya que en el calendario podemos retroceder o adelantar. De igual manera, si las fechas proporcionadas, vamos a tener que buscar el mes y la fecha indicada desde el inicio del módulo. En la fecha de finalización, de igual manera proporcionada por nosotros, vamos a desplazar el calendario y así vamos a seleccionar el día en el cual está finalizando el curso. En el punto número 14, vamos a colocar una valoración personal que se ha recibido de parte del desarrollo del curso. Posteriormente, ustedes pueden seleccionar algunos cursos de otro interés o algún comentario que ustedes tengan respecto al trabajo desarrollado. Vamos a darle clic en el botón azul de enviar y posteriormente vamos a recibir un mensaje de la respuesta a su enviado. Cuando ustedes han recibido este mensaje, favor de tomar una cartilla de pantalla compartirla al grupo de WhatsApp correspondiente junto con su nombre completo, según nosotros que tenemos registrado. Ok. Y es así como tú debes desarrollar la encuesta de satisfacción. Vaya, perfecto. Ya hoy ya estamos listos, ¿verdad? Con eh, la forma en que vamos a entrar a, a llenar la encuesta de certificación. ¿Lograron ver sus, sus correos? ¿Sí? ¿Verificaron que recibieron la información necesaria en sus correos? Yes. yes. Aquí en el WhatsApp les acaban de compartir. Eh, cierta información, que de hecho va a ser bien importante para que ustedes la utilicen. Ahora, acá está el enlace para que abran la encuesta, la encuesta de satisfacción, ya la tengo abierta. Está el enlace para tomar la encuesta. Denle clic al enlace. Vamos a ir llenándola uno a uno. Recuerden el, el número completo de la orden de inicio está acá. Orden de inicio, ustedes le van a copiar completo, ¿verdad? Que no le falte absolutamente nada. Copiamos el número de encuesta de satisfacción, nos lo llevamos y lo pegamos en el espacio. Por eso les decía, es bien importante que verifiquen el correo con la información que les mandaron. Porque ahí usted solamente va a ir copiando y pegando la información así como lo vieron en el video, ¿verdad? ¿Ya? Orden de inicio, solo copy y paste. No lo digitan, sino que lo copian y lo pegan. Después nos vamos al nombre completo, igual en el correo que usted recibió, ahí le va a aparecer su nombre completo. Recuerden, nombre completo, tal como usted está registrado en inglés corporativo. Si alguno no recibió su correo, me dice, oye, para poder yo mandarle la información eh, vía privada acá de, de Zoom. Miss, podría hacer, bueno, en lo personal, me podría hacer un favor de compartir el link de la encuesta en el grupo de Zoom. Porque no puedo entrar al, a Inter ahorita. No puede entrar por WhatsApp. Ok. No. Yo no voy a entrar por WhatsApp, teacher. Discúlpeme porque he tenido problemas con el Zoom. Por medio de WhatsApp me mandaron el link. Está bien, está bien. Puedo entrar. Ahí está el link. Es lo mismo, ¿verdad? Ya sea que usted entre por el 
por el link de WhatsApp o que entre por el link de Zoom es exactamente lo mismo. ¿Alguien no recibió el correo, me dice Elisa? Ok. Vale, voy a dejar de compartir para compartirle a Belisario su información. Si alguien más no recibió el correo con la información, me dice, porque recuerden que es bien importante que usted vaya copiando y pegando la información. ¿Todos los demás si de, recibieron su correo? Yes, sir. Al compartir la fotografía, eh, bueno, la captura, mejor dicho, recuerden el ejemplo que vieron, ¿verdad? Al final del video, que usted tiene que ponerle, poner la captura con su nombre. ¿Sí? Recuerden, copian, pegan su nombre completo, copian, pegan correo electrónico, el número de celular, igual el número que le fue provisto eh, en el correo, ¿verdad? Para que no me vaya a poner otro. Sexo femenino, sexo masculino. Departamento de residencia, ese lo busca con flechitas, Santana, Sonsonate, Sonsonate. Okay. Buscan su departamento, igual el municipio sí tienen que digitarlo, ¿verdad? Porque ese no se los, no se los dan, entonces sí tienen que digitarlo. El nombre de la empresa, recuerde que usted me escribe la razón social de su empresa, no el nombre comercial. El número de... Vaya, la, eh, la empresa donde usted trabaja es la razón social, ¿verdad? El nombre de su proveedor, acá lo busca en inglés corporativo, Regal International. El nombre del curso también, acá se le da eh, inglés principiante módulo 4, solamente le da eh, copiar sin las comillas, ¿verdad? Ahí se lo pongo eh, de ensayo. Fecha de inicio, 6 de marzo. Vamos a ver. Inglés corporativo, o inglés principiante, perdón, módulo 4. Solo copiamos y pegamos. Sin las comillas, ¿verdad? Valore los aspectos, cómo considera el tiempo empleado, qué opina del contenido, qué opina de la opinión de las opciones de herramientas tecnológicas utilizadas en el curso. 
la fecha de inicio del curso, recuerden que es 6 de marzo, ¿verdad? 6 de marzo, lo tienen que marcar en el calendario. Uh -huh. Y la fecha de finalización, que sería la fecha de hoy. ¿Cuál es su nivel de satisfacción? Recuerde que en este aspecto tiene que tomar en cuenta eh, la manera en que se le han servido las clases, la manera en que se le ha atendido de parte de ILE corporativo. No tome en cuenta si le falló el internet, si no le falló el internet, que el manual tenía errores. Eso no tiene, no tiene que ver con nosotros, ¿verdad? Entonces, eso, esos son los aspectos que tiene que tomar en cuenta, cómo se le sirvió el, el, las clases, ¿verdad? De qué manera se le atendió de parte de inglés corporativo. Y si tiene algún otro curso que le gustaría tomar, lo agregamos acá. Si tiene comentarios también, le dan su Muy bien, veo que ya varios terminaron, ya enviaron su... Exacto, sí, con el nombre completo, muy bien. Hay 10 y 7, ¿verdad? 17 acá, vamos a ver. Brian finished. Eric. Eric. Reina. Reina. Daniel, el curso, el 6, ¿verdad? ¿Mm? No, Fecha Clarice. en que inició el curso. Ah. Fecha de inicio. Eh, Clarixa, hágame un favor. Cheque la información que le han mandado y solo vaya copiando. Ah, sí, sí, el correo. Sí, sí, sí voy a hacer. Sí, no me dijiste nada. Permítame. Solo vaya copiando y pegando. Oye. Ok. Fecha de inicio 6 de marzo. Nombre del curso. Inglés. Principiante módulo 4, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Módulo del curso. Inglés principiante módulo 4. Me falta... A ver, Reina, Lupita, Rosalía, falta Vanessa. Muy bien. Y ve ya, ¿verdad? Sí. Aquí estamos. Me falta Belisario y Clarix. ¿Cómo vamos, Clarix? Ya casi, Ticha. Ya lo mando. Ok.
Camilo. No, ah, ya está Camilo también. Y me falta. Leca. Deborah, is Deborah here? If you have any questions, tell me, Clarissa. Sí, teacher, ya va. Sí, de marzo. Fecha sí, sí. Sí, sí, ya lo puse. Okay,
La Alexa, la Alexa. Bueno, I'm going to share eh, the sentences I told you we're going to do while Clarissa finishes. Okay. There you go. Remember, you're going to complete with this, that, this, and those, depending on the situation there. Let me know when you finish so we can check.
Oh, I see, Lavix have finished, right? Nice. Ahí va a disculpar que tenía problemas y me veo a... la captura, no hice más. Va, ok. ¿Usted la conexión? Con razón. Y me descargó. Ok. A ver, a ver. Are you ready? I'm going to send you to the room so you can go compare your answers. I already pasted the exercise in the chat. Try to join, please. Trying to join. If you cannot join a group, you can stay here and work together here then. Um, yeah, ya la, ya la. Ya la encontró. Do you like this? Do you like this? This. This. Um, eh, pero T-H-E-S-E. Porque son dos zapatos, shoes. El par. Ajá. Entonces, ese se dice des, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Con Eva. Des, ajá, uh, des. Ajá, uh -huh. I'm wearing. I bought them. 
in a sale. Number two. I like this shoe. It looks really good mm -hmm. of you. This shirt. Mm -hmm. Number three. I love the earrings. Yeah. Wearing. Are they appreciated? I love those. 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 Uh -huh. Uh -huh. those. Earring to wearing. With the present. Dos, cuatro, four. I should have it as chocolate. Esa no la comprendo. Pero... I can. Ah. Uh... La del chocolate, no. ¿Quién se ha comido chocolate? Sería como esto, ¿verdad? ¿Quién se ha comido? Ajá. Sería como estos chocolates. Sería como el, el des. ¿El des o dos? Ah. ¿Dos como son esos? Son... Yo creo que sería el des porque. I feel sick. Es como que, como que son de él y él los está preguntando. Uh -huh. mm, así lo veo yo. Ajá. Uh -huh. Para mí sería el, el test. Test, test. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I see. Um, uh, noise. Pero ahí tengo duda yo no es. Uh -huh. En la cuatro. Porque dice que no debió haber comido. ¿Cómo es? ¿Esos o estos chocolates? Puede, puede, puede ser de la ah, tos. Ah, la cuatro. Es la cuatro, ajá. Ah, pero dice chocolates. Ajá. Ajá, dice, dice como, como... Puede ser todos esos o todos esos. Ajá, es como, como plural. Ajá, se, se siente como plural o... Como pues es plural, mucho. porque son, ajá, no es solo uno. Uh -huh. Pero, ¿está cerca o están lejos? Puede estar así, che. piso dos. Ahí tengo dos. Sí, 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 ya uh -huh. ¿Por qué voy a decir poder comer estos chocolates? O, o esos, o esos chocolates. chocolates. O esos chocolates. Ajá. Por haberme los comido. Ajá. Ajá. Ahí tengo dudas. Démosle así. Va el 5. I think mm. this café is too noise. Los 5. I think. I think. Eh, no, ¿qué será? Ay, Lupita. Ay, Miss. Vamos a ver si logra entrar este Manuel. Ya entró. Sí. 
sí, a España. Miss. Ay. A mí me sacó de la plataforma. Volví a entrar, pero ya no alcancé el grupo. Aquí lo jalé para donde Lupita porque había quedado solita. A ver con quién estaba Lupita antes. No, nadie se conectó. Ay. Hasta después creo que entró y se Mejor sola que mal acompañada. Dios. <risa> <risa> Espere que le salga su balán. Ni me sale ni nada. Ah, así como que de reojo. La misma me manda ni uno. Ni uno. Qué es que lo que pasa es que yo se los mando, pero ellos no llegan. ¿no? Vale. <risa> así Ay, no. Miedo le tienen los que vaya a salir que estaba aquí con ella. Imagine. Imagine. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Contestar. Para su respuesta. Miss, yo no sé si entiendo bien. Yo la contesté. Uh -huh. La primera, do you like these shoes? Do you like this? Plural, ¿verdad? No. plural. No. La segunda, no. I like this shirt, porque es una. Ajá. ¿La primera cuál puso? This, pero plural. Porque son zapatos. Uh -huh. La segunda, I like this shirt. La tercera, I love this and earrings. This. Yes. Eso va. This earrings, ajá. Okay. Como esos, ¿no? No, estos. La otra, I show them, have Aiden O tools, chocolate. Those chocolates. Those chocolate. La otra, I think. This coffee's to nerves. This coffee's uh, to? To nursing. Oh, who do you say? N nursing. No, oh, no, sí. This no café, sí. no coffee, café. Oh. This café is too noisy. ¿Qué significa eso? El café es la cafetería. Oh, ok. Uh -huh. I like the city, ¿no? Let's finish our drink and go somewhere else. La otra, las siete. What are you doing this day? Days. Y la última. Who is this car over there? Who's? 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 Who's is this? Estoy bien. Mm, pero dice over there. No puede ser this porque dice over there, ¿verdad? Over there. Us. Y si dice over there, ¿qué significa? Allí. Entonces es that lejos. ¿Cómo sería that? That car over there. Not over there. Ah, en esa me equivoqué. Vamos a poner 9.99. Cabas. 9.99. O 9.50. <ríe> <ríe> Okay. Va, pues no estoy tan mal. No, estamos bien. Estamos bien. Está triste, mis, que ya se acaba. Sí, hombre. Sí, sí. Gracias, Luba. Pero ya va a tener vacation. Ya vamos a descansar un rato. Sí. 
Sí. Una semanita. Yo desde el viernes estoy descansando. Hasta ya me aburrí de descansar. <risa> sí. No, tanto que hacer. No, ¿Qué trabajo? No tengo que hacer. Descansa, descanso. ¿Y en qué trabaja, Lupita? Eh, en la alcaldía. Ah, con razón. <ríe> yeah. Ya bien galán, ¿verdad? Sí, soy asistente de auditoría interna. Wow. Por eso. Numbers, numbers, numbers. Y Manuel, ¿qué do you do? Uh, Wednesday. ¿Mm? Wednesday. Vacation, inicio en uh, vacation. Ah, te falta. Yes. When, do you, when did you start vacation? Oh. Wednesday. You started on Wednesday. <laughs> or you will start on Wednesday. Pasado mañana, termino. Termina. O sea, eh, start vacation. Uh, what's that called? Thursday. You go on vacation on Wednesday. Yes. Okay. So that means that you oh, today you're still working. Yes, miss. Okay. Today, okay. tomorrow, tomorrow, and Wednesday. And Wednesday all day. Yes. Oh. I'm still working tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow because I have to check the, 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 the grades, right? If no, I will be on vacation completely. Todavía tengo gente pendiente de completar plataforma, imagine. Eh, a Débora dijo que ya yeah, iba a ver cómo entraba para hacer. Ahorita está activo aquí con nosotros. Ah, va a Aquí ser. acabo de entrar en esto. Sí, porque ah, tuvo sí. problema con el Inter, ¿verdad? Ajá. Sí, es que ya es que sabe qué le pasa a Zoom. Que se pone a estar sacando gente. Está cansado también. Ya. Ya ah, ya quiere vacation. <ríe> vacation ah, por Zoom. Yeah. Zoom. 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 Zoom will have a vacation soon. Yes. And day, Miss. Mm -hmm. And day. Yes. Imagine. Bueno, well, vamos, pues. Let's Mama. go. Okay, coming. Vamos a ver how many seconds. Hmm, 30 seconds for everybody to be back. Nine seconds. Okay, bah, we'll see. We are complete here. A ver, number one. Do you like? Good night, teacher. This. Do you like this? Yes. This, shows. Do you like these shoes I'm wearing? I bought them in a safe. 
Okay, number two. This. I like. I like this shirt. Uh -huh. I like this shirt. It looks really good on you. What about number three? I love. This. Uh -huh, I will go more for this. I love these earrings you're wearing. Oh. Were they a present? They a present. Yes. Number four. I shouldn't have it. I shouldn't all. have any. There's chocolate. Ay, sí, le vamos a poner dos porque ya no existen los chocolates. Ya lo comió, ya no están. I shouldn't have eaten all those chocolates. I feel sick. <laughs> those. Um, whenever we're talking about the past, we use that or those. Okay. Now, what about number five? I think. I think. I think this coffee? cafe. Mm -hmm. I think this cafe is too noisy. Too noisy. Let, let's finish yeah. our drink. Let's finish our drinks and also. So what else? And number six, I like. This, this city. I like this city. I like this. I like this city. I've been living here since I was a little girl. What about number seven? Those. What are you doing those days? These days. What are you doing these days? Are you still at college? Yes, yeah. What about number eight? Who is that? that? Car? Who's that? Who's car? That? Car Who's car? Who is that car over there? Who is that car over there? Who's is that car over there? It's in my space. Right? Okay, now repeat. Do you like these shoes I'm wearing? I bought them in a sale. Do you like these like shoes so I'm wearing? I bought them in a sale. I like this shirt. It looks really good on you. I like this, like this shirt. shirt. It looks it really good really on you. I love these earrings you're wearing. Were they a present? I love I these love earrings you're wearing. Were they wearing. Were they they you are wearing. Were they a present? I shouldn't have eaten all those chocolates. I feel sick. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have, have eaten all those chocolates. I think this cafe is too noisy. Let's finish your drinks and go somewhere else. I think this cafe is too noisy. Let's finish our drinks and go somewhere else. I like this city. I've been living here since I was a little girl. 
I like this city. I have been living here since I like this city. I have been here since I was a little girl. What are you doing these days? Are you still at college? Who is that over there? Is in my space. ¿Quiénes son esos carros? 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 ¿Quiénes son And complete the sentences using this, that, these, and those. Two minutes for you to do it, and then we check. Are you ready? ¿Cómo podrías tú comprar alguna de estas? Ella no me estaba funcionando. Y el mandato lo es. Hombre, vamos a hablar a la mujer. Que le han mandado las mujeres hasta el tiempo. Llamar, hacer que le vas a comprar. 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 Que le vas a comprar.
Mm-hmm. How are you doing? Are you ready? Yes, miss. Yes, miss. Vamos a ver. Yes, miss. How could you buy something like this? This. this. Like this. Because it says I, that the I is it. The forces yes. 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 Remember que no es death, sino que es this. This. Ah, this. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. This. 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 Yo le puse de este, che. I have to wear this comforter. This. 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 Yeah, because you are walking at that moment, you're not wearing the shoes. I have to wear this comfortable shoe. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Number four. Can the you please meet me that? That. that. Copale. That. Uh -huh. Can you bring me that cup I left? Uh -huh. Those are those, those are Mr. Those are Mr. Children. And that picture. That that picture you see my wife, my wife on and that shirt. No questions. Okay. Bye. Now let's go to talk about can and could. Can and could. Remember, we were saying that we use can and could for making requests, right? What can you mm -hmm. When do we use can and when do we use could? When could you come to help me paint the house? Uh -huh. okay. What can you do? Mm -hmm. Complete the idea. Mm -hmm. 
remember, we use can and could for making requests. Um, where can you put play in basketball? Mm, where no. can you play uh, basketball? What? what? Mm -hmm. Play no. basketball. Where can you play basketball? Okay. How could you travel? Right? How could you travel to the office? A ver, deje de compartir, ¿verdad? A ver, I'm going to give you a couple of minutes for you to rewrite the equations and then we check together. Remember making requests, requests. ¿Qué es una request? When I ask for Pregunta. something, right? Uh -huh. Are you ready? Ready, ready. Who has question number one? What can you 
What can you do about that problem? What can you do about that problem? Okay. Okay, what can you do about that, about that problem? Number two. When, when could you... When could when you could study you, English? Could you help me? Could you help me? Because it would be a request. But when could you help me study English? Okay, when could you help me study English? Aha. Number three. <clears throat> Where can you travel the next vacation? Where can you travel when you miss? Where can you travel on your next vacation? How could you? <clears throat> How could you help me? How could you help me? How could you help? Mm -hmm. How could you help me with this exercise? Mm -hmm. Okay, who can you, who can you, simple, <laughs> who can you call, uh -huh. or who can you invite? Who can you invite to the party? Ah, and number six. Why could you? Why could you? Why could you open the door? Because I had the key. Right? Any question? No? No question? Okay. <laughs> Exactly. I'm checking that it is correct, correct grammatically talking, right? Grammatically correct. Okay. Uh -huh. So check that it has to be correct. How could you? Could you talk? Could you talk? Not talking, verdad? Talk. Talk. 
another part of the review right we're about to look at the sentences and then choose the correct options right which word completes the sentence would you like would you like coming or would you like to come would you like to come would you like to come to my house for dinner Yes. Okay. And uh, there will be a number two, sorry. In which sentence can you write would like? Analyze the sentences. I play in tennis with my friends to work with animals in the future. Oh, I like pizza. It's my favorite food. Which there sentence? Be? Which sentence can you you uh, can you complete using would like? I would like to work with animal in the picture. Mm -hmm. I would like like can you say I would like can you say I would like like pizza I would like no. I would like playing ¿Sí? My favorite food. Este es mi, mi comida favorita. Mm. Don't translate, Clarissa. Don't translate. The, the thinking the structure. I would like playing tennis. I would like playing tennis. I would like. I would like. I would like. Okay. So you say, I would like to work with the animals in the future. I would like to work with animals in the future. What about number three? Yes, yes. Number three. Which sentence is not correct? Which is not correct? Which is not correct? I wouldn't like all the dough. I wouldn't like own a doll. I love some chocolate cake. I wouldn't like any more tea. Thank you. Okay. 
which is the best option? Letter B means? Letter B, exactly. The best option is B. I love some chocolate cake. What about number four? Mm -hmm. Will your friend later see? Letter C. Would your friends like to come to dinner too? No. Uh -huh. Would your friends like to come for dinner too? And number five, which is the best answer to this question? Would you like a biscuit? Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Remember that a question with wood is not answer with wood, right? Would you like would you like a biscuit? Yes, please. Aha, uh -huh. what about this one? Complete the sentence. My husband. Mm -hmm. My husband would eat me. Let it be. Light. Let it be. Are you sure? Light. Letter eight. Letter eight. If he eats light. Light every day, we're talking about likes and dislikes, right? Mm -hmm. right? If you say, my husband would like a banana. He is eating ice cream right now. In that case, you may say good luck, but if no, you're talking about likes and dislikes, right? Okay, number seven. Complete the question. Let it be. Let it be. Are you sure? Letter eight. Let it in. Again, we're talking about likes and dislikes. Mm. Do you like listening to classical music? Yes, thank you. Do you like? But if you would, it would be, would you like to listen? Would you like to listen to classical music? Listening, listening to classical music. Would you like to listen to classical music? Do you like to listen to classic music? A ver, para para nombre. A ver, había allá Yes. When would you like to visit us? Would you like, right? In which sentence can you write like? Solo like, no I like, sino que only like. Which sentence? When? Letter A. E. Uh -huh. I really e. like these like scary films. E. Yes. E. And the last one. This part of the city looks dangerous. I wouldn't like to come. To come. To come. See? I wouldn't like mm -hmm. to come. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't like to come when it starts. Nice, nice, nice. Any questions here? Some questions. No questions? No? No. Okay, perfect. Now let's 
go for the last attendance of the day. Vamos a ver. Brian Alexander. Camilo. Clarixa. Presente, Ticho. Present. Daniel Eduardo. Present, Ticho. Débora. Here. Okay. Elmer Antonio. Present, Ticho. Nice. Eric Gerardo. Eric. Erika Joana. Present teacher. Isaías Santana. Ivette Elvira. Present teacher. Okay. Carla Vanessa. Luis Enrique. A él le sacó la plataforma. Verdad, ya no puedo entrar. Manuel Antonio. Present Miss. Reina Estela. Reina, reina, reina. Estuvo, ¿verdad? Mi, Miss. Reina. No, Lupita. Reina, reina, reina. Ah, escuché que ya estuvo. <risas> no, reina, no, que ando buscando a reina. No, ¿verdad? Reina no está. Rosibel. Presente, Cher. Al principio sí, ahí estaba reina, saber qué le pasó. Vanessa Victoria. Lisa. El Lupita. Aquí. <risas> Belisario. Present. Nice, nice. Bueno, we have gotten to the end. It was a pleasure. Continue working hard, right? Continue learning. And uh, be ready for the beginning, uh, the beginning of the course. It's program for after vacation, right? So be ready to well, be ready to enter there in the new course. Well, it was a pleasure. So have fun on your vacations. Enjoy your vacations if you're already on vacations. Or if you're waiting for them to arrive, okay. a fan, enjoy your vacation, and see you in the future, right? See you in the future. Thank you, Remember teacher. Bye, that you, Miss. That you, you can continue everything. looking at the links that you have in the book, so you can continue practicing if you have the time, right? Okay. Okay. Bye bye. Bye. Okay. Bye. 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 See you. Gracias por todo. Happy vacation. Welcome. Thank you. Thank thing. you, teacher. Enjoy the week. Bye. Bye bye. 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 Thank you. Thank you. The same to you. Enjoy your vacation. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Bye bye, Rosie. Bye, teacher. Thank you. Bye-bye, Belisario. Take care.